This year's Royal Remembrance events have now begun, and will culminate in the Cenotaph Service on Remembrance Sunday. The Queen has planted her own cross of remembrance following prayers and a two-minute silence in the field of remembrance in the grounds Westminster Abbey. The field, an annual event, brings serving members of the armed forces, veterans and forces families together in the grounds of the Abbey remember friends, colleagues and loved ones who lost their lives in service. Twenty twenty three marks the field's ninety fifth anniversary. Her Majesty spoke to veterans, armed forces personnel, and poppy factory supporters at the event. The Field of Remembrance has been organized by the Poppy Factory and held in the grounds of Westminster Abbey since November nineteen twenty eight to commemorate those who have lost their lives serving in the armed forces. Ex-service men and women, as well as members of the public, can plant a cross or a symbol carrying a personal message in memory of those who have lost their lives in the service of others. This year there are 308 plots including plots that Her Majesty is associated with including the Rifles, the Royal Lancers, the Grenadier Guards, the Royal Army Champlains Department, the Submariner Association, H. M.S. Astute. The Poppy Factory supports members of the armed forces community on their journey into employment, helping them overcome any barriers. Each year it helps hundreds of veterans to change their lives. This year it launched two new services, a pre-employment service and an employment service for families, helping even more members of the armed forces community across England and Wales. The charity's employment support for veterans with health conditions began at its factory in Richmond upon Thames, where members of the production team have been making remembrance wreaths for the Royal British Legion and the Royal Family since 1922. Her Majesty the Queen visited the factory in November 2021 to open its new visitor centre. 